author of the common reading book, Into the Beautiful North, visited PLU this past Thursday, September 13th. Luis Alberto Herrera gave a speech to students and faculty discussing his life and its impact on the novel. Students had much to say about Into the Beautiful North. I liked the portrayal of Mexico as a developing world country, and I also enjoyed the examples of coming into the U.S. and the things that struck her. Having lived overseas myself, I found it very interesting how they reflected on the U.S. personally didn't enjoy it. I felt that the whole book, um, it wasn't very believable. As the, through the eyes of the main character, it always kind of felt like it was a male presence writing it, and it was supposed to be this really strong female character, but as the reader, you, didn't, you never really got into it or really believed that it was her, and you're always kind of conscious of the fact that a man was writing it. Professors had their own opinions as well. Um, I was really moved by the story. Um, it's sort of um, quest um, format, um, I thought really engaging, and I really loved the main character, Nayeli. A lot of women were, and, and male readers as well, were troubled by the sexualization and sensualization of his female protagonist. Um, and others thought that the novel was too generous to the American reader at the expense of the depiction of Mexican culture. Luis Sorero delivered his speech to faculty and students in the Mary Baker Russell Concert Hall. Buenas tardes, Tacoma, Washington. Tijuana in the house. I love humor. As I tell my writing students, humor is a virus that infects everybody with humanity. After his speech, Urero signed copies of his book. PLU's president, Thomas Kreis, commented on the speech as well. It was great to have Luis here for the, for the common read and for an inaugural event. It's very nice.